In 2008, California ranked dead last in terms of funding for the arts. There are entire school districts in the state of California that have virtually no arts programming. What the data shows us is that on average, low-income students immersed in a long-term arts-rich environment score 46% higher than their peers in every academic measure. That means math, English, science. In districts all over the state, the arts have been cut to find ways to balance the budget. That's why we decided to create the Los Angeles School of Arts and Entertainment. Any, any given minute walking in the South Central to school, it, you can either get in a fight or uh, an altercation or approach by a gang or, or watch somebody get shot or get beat up. It was pretty, uh, pretty scary. My name is Gregory C. Smith, um, born and raised in uh, South Central Los Angeles, and I'm a son of a preacher's man. I was a musician in my father's church, uh, played all the instruments, guitar to bass to organ, sang in the choir. My day was pretty much wake up, go to school, survive, get to school safely, study, do my classes, get home safely, and then go to church. If it wasn't for music, I, I probably would have crossed that line. When you think about education being the key thing for opportunity in America across history, right? I mean, the ability to get an education. How much will communities be changed when you have a higher number of kids going to college now than going to prison? Whereas the opposite is the case right now in many of these schools and many of these school districts. Why don't the kids in this area have access to what the kids in the other areas have access to? These kids, they don't have guidance or resources. It's not that far on the freeway from South Central Los Angeles. We're so close geographically and we might as well be a million miles away from some of these kids um, conceptually. And really all they need is access. The mission of the LA School of Arts and Entertainment is to improve student achievement through high quality arts education and to provide a bridge between South Los Angeles youth and the employment opportunities in the entertainment industry. The musical director is the most important person to the performer. Like Madonna and Jennifer Lopez, Michael Jackson chose Michael Bearden. Yeah, it's not, it's, not, it's not the right sound, so imagine this is the right sound, check this. I'm Michael Bearden, I come from the south side of Chicago. I was exposed to music, one, through my dad, two, through, uh, we had family members that used to babysit us, uh, so one babysitter we had, I remember, and I might have been about four, she used to come over and babysit us. You know, the cool thing about music early and knowing what you want to do for for your living is that you're on a path, a laser beam. So gangs and drugs and all this stuff are over here and they're hovering, but your laser is here, so that's a great thing. Providing instruction in music, dance, drama, and the visual arts, the school will train the next generation of artists and technicians for the entertainment industry. I remember when I wanted to be a cameraman, I had to go to a school way out in Hollywood to learn how to be a cameraman. There was nobody teaching that in South Central. You know, it was like, why well, have to go so far? Although arts teachers make up only 5% of all teachers in LAUSD, they make up 30% of all teachers who receive pink slips. And they come from communities where the unemployment level is staggered. So our ability to train people for the jobs of this region, which because it's Los Angeles also means the jobs for an international market, are important. With this project that we're starting, the vision is to become the hub where kids are known to come out of our school or our, our facility with an education, scholarship of some type, and a job in the entertainment business. What I bring to the table and why I was so interested to meet Greg was I needed somebody like Greg that had access, that had his feet on the ground in the areas where the need was the greatest. Through good fortune, I'm in a situation where I am able to offer a glimpse into what's possible. There are not only opportunities for great performers on the set of Lopez tonight, there are great people behind the scenes that are recording the music and deciding what the art direction is going to look like and lighting the stage and writing the copy and camera angles. And every one of those ancillary can be found through picking up a horn or picking up a paintbrush. I plan on bringing 
a lot of great talent and a lot of great mentorship uh, to this to the Belief Foundation. So. We can connect the dots and get those kids from South Central Los Angeles to see more of their faces. I believe. We believe. Do you believe?